Life in the 608 depends on how you live it. We know Wisconsin winters can be brutal, especially if you don't like being outside and all the elements. But for one area man, it's what he's made a career out of. In the 608 this morning, Josh Breider is live at Tenney Park. Good morning, Josh. Skating like a pro out there. <laughs> Good morning, guys. We are having so much fun out here on Tenney Park this morning. Woo! <laughs> it is a great morning to be outside right before the snow, of course, as you mentioned. We are at the Teddy Park Skating Rink. Madisonians love to take advantage of all things here in the city parks across this beautiful capital city. But there's one guy here that's been making this skating rink happen for more than three decades, and I learned pretty quickly he's quite the character. Okay. This is Warren Lyerly, <laughs> but everyone calls him Junior. You'll see the Madison native most days at Tenney Park. I enjoy what I do and I love what I do. In the winter, that means tending to the ice rinks. And if you think this is an easy job... I've fallen through right out here, never touch bottom. Think again. It's a kind of a nerve-wracking thing, but the days go by real fast and it's really rewarding at the end of the day. He's worked for the city of Madison for more than 32 years, most of that time with the Parks Division. Junior says it's the camaraderie with his fellow workers that keeps him coming back. When they're getting at me, they call me the ice whisperer. <laughs> you know, this is a great group of guys. We've been together for a long time. When I asked him what kinds of jobs he does, I should have asked him what he doesn't do. This man is all over, right alongside the others. A lot of guys are from the north side, are hockey players, the sports. They love being out in the parks, and they do take this to heart, so we do the best we can. Junior tells me he can't help but smile at the end of the day as he drives by, seeing all of the skaters taking advantage of what living in the 608 has to offer. We always get stopped, and people giving us a thumbs up and tell that they appreciate what we do. Keeps us motivated. And out here live at Tenney Park this morning. Of course, I'm the only one out here on skates. Photographer Mark Schilling, he wasn't quite brave enough to put the skates on today. We had him on the snowshoes yesterday, but today's a little different when we got a big camera like that. A couple of the guys just showed up. They are actually working on the hockey rink so far, but days like this, obviously, when there's snow coming, they kind of have to pivot and work on other things. But on most days, including today, Tenney Park Skating Rink is open, and today's actually one of the days they have the rentals available. Wednesday through Sunday, they have rentals available for just a small fee here at Tenney Park. There are a couple of rules, including this mask. Some of you probably wondering why I'm having a mask on outside. Well, that's one of the things they ask for, and they also have some other stuff. We're going to talk about that coming up at 6.30 and how you can kind of take advantage of some of the best of Wisconsin winters. Guys, it's been many years since I've had the hockey skates on. Of course, you know I'm a Minnesota boy. I grew up in a hockey family, but I was a little nervous this morning, but so far, no falls, no twisted ankles or anything like that. Oh, now I probably just jinx myself. <laughs> <laughs> so Zach's family got me ice skates for Christmas. I don't know what you're doing later, Josh, but you want to show me a thing or two? Hey, let's do it. I'm guessing that these rinks are going to be quite busy today with that snow day here in Madison, especially before all of that snow falls down. They're going to be busy here, of course, clearing all that snow so everyone can take advantage of that. Oh, perfect day for it. Thanks, Josh. So remember to let Josh know what inspires you in the 608. You can reach out to him on social media or use a new email in the 608 at WISCTV.com. Shoot him an email for a chance to be featured.